Alright, here we are at the Marquee Printing Company. And we've got this other guy who looks like an actor that I've seen in many movies before, standing inside. Alright. Come on, Bukowski. We're going in. Uh, let's do the good cop, bad cop routine on him and see see if he uh, if he crumbles under the pressure. What can I do for you, gentlemen? Shut your mouth. I'm a traffic detective from Central Division. Who's in charge here? I am. Gordon Lightfall. Oh, yeah. What's this about? We understand that your company prints California vehicle titles. Yeah. Yes, I have the government contract to print pink slips. I've done for some years. No, oh, yeah? Have you had any goods or equipment stolen recently? We're running up against stolen cars with seemingly legitimate paperwork. Yeah, well, you got a whole Not bunch of DVD recently. players out back? Uh, have you ruled out forgery? No. There's no shortage of talented artists in this town. Oh. We'll keep it in mind. All right, uh, do we want to talk to this asshole? Yeah. We have some questions for you, Mr. Lightball. Yeah, that's right. Uh, do you have any knowledge of the theft racket? Look at this shady character. What a fucking guy. Mr. Lightball, we're currently working two auto theft cases. Do you know anything about a car theft ring? Uh, certainly not. Why would I get mixed up in a thing like that? Uh, I'm going to doubt you, maybe rightly or wrongly, because your eyes are shifting around. We have suspects yeah. with legitimate pink slips that were printed here, Lightfall. You better give me something before I bring the whole department down here. Yeah. Don't be hysterical, detective. Don't call me hysterical, As a matter of Lightfall. Fact, we had a similar problem a couple of years oh, ago. Oh, is that right? A number of used car lots were selling blank documents to a criminal organization. Uh, pink slip supply. Fine. Uh, where is this steady supply of pink slips coming from, Gordon? Do the names Cliff Harrison and James Belasco mean anything to you? No, they do not. Hey. Look at that. Look at, look at old shifty eyes here. Yeah. Harrison bought his car from Coombs. The pink slip looks good, and that points the finger here. Yeah. Do you have any employee Gordy? trouble? No, I don't. They've all been carefully screened. Yeah, right. Look, now that I think about it, the name Coombs sounds familiar. Oh, does he I now, think they Gordon? They may have been involved in stolen documents in the past. Coombs, eh? Coombs Auto Deliveries. Huh. Look at you. Look a little bit sweaty, Gordon. Hey, you. Uh, you a little bit hot under the collar. Listen, I'm busy. You know where the door is. Oh, you. You think you're talking to? All right, Coombs Auto Delivery. You have a delivery ledger, Mr. Lightfall. Yeah. We would like to cross-check against the Coombs Automotive Emporium. Yeah, we would. It's a little out of the ordinary, Detective. Uh, I'm not sure I can share those sorts of records. I think you can, you son of a bitch. We're gonna doubt him. He looks pretty worried. He looks really worried. Hand it over, Lightball. Yeah. You don't want us having bad thoughts about no, you. No, I mean, Gordon, I'm Very having well. bad thoughts already. This really is irregular. Over here. Well, I'll tell you what else is irregular, Gordon. That vest that you're wearing. Holy shit. I mean, talk about a disaster. All right. We're going to open the ledger with our fi with our pointer finger. This is the best part of the whole game. Look for patterns, recurring names, unusual addresses, anything out of the ordinary. Oh, hey, look over here. We've got Deuce Bigelow once, Deuce Bigelow twice. I don't know if you remember, Gene Archer was talking about Mr. Bigelow. Look at all these Bigelows. Looks like you got some uh, some repeat business here, Gordon, in the form of Bigelow. You certainly yeah. encourage repeat business, Lightball. This Mr. Bigelow is a good customer. He sure is. What do you think of that? Sorry to bother you, sir. We'll let you know if there are any developments. Yeah, that's right, you fucking asshole. See you later. See you in jail. Come on, Bukowski. Get off your ass. We're going back. We're going to go to this thing, and we're going to go to this warehouse and see if there's some goons there or something. I don't know what the fuck. 58 Industrial Street. All right. We have 58 Industrial Street. We're going to get to the bottom of this large warehouse in Industrial District. There we go. All right. You're driving, Bukowski. Can you drive to this one? Can you drive to all of them? I prefer it when you drive, actually. Oh, shit. Watch out. Fifty-eight 
68 Industrial Street, 4.34 p.m. Here we go. I think we should call for a couple of black and whites. Get Fleischer down here. I thought you Marines were gung-ho, Cole. Yeah, Cole. 45, don't you ever want to use it? No. I'll take the back. Just give me a few seconds to get around. I haven't cleaned it. What if my bullets go stray? I'm not ready for this. Come out with your hands up. Mikowski's angry and jumping over boxes out here. All right. We're going to have to put our best sharpshooting Cole skills Phelps, to the LAPD. test. LAPD. All of you are coming downtown with me. You're never going to take take me alive, copper. Oh, look at this fucking guy. All right, who wants some? It's you. Shit. Bam. bam. You got one. Reload. All right. Here we go. Oh. Oh no. I'm hiding behind the door because I'm a baby. I'm going to hide behind these barrels now because I'm a baby. And also behind this because I'm a baby. Who wants some? Who wants some? Bam, bam. Oh shit, no. Headshot. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. What a beautiful... Oh shit, I hit the paint can. Oh, look at this. I'm waiting for you. I'm in cover. Oh, right in the face. I hit that guy in the face. I got that guy in the neck. I'm gonna get this guy in the balls, even though he's behind the box. Oh, look at that. Right in the heart. Shot directly through the heart. Oh, no. He lived to tell the tale. How did he survive that? Whoa. Mikowski, what are you using over there? A rocket launcher? Holy shit. I don't know if that's necessary, Bikowski. Put away the rocket launcher. Just use your pistol like a real man. Watch out. This is pretty intense. Oh, I hit him in the back of the head, Bikowski. Don't worry, I'm gonna hit this guy in the back of the... Is that him? No. It's like some sort of sink or something? Where the hell did he go? I thought that was him. What are you even shooting at, Bukowski? What the hell? Oh, there he is. I've seen him. Shoot this. Oh, look, I can get him. Put your weapons down and your hands in the air. Yeah. It's too late now. Let's clear the top floor, okay? We're gonna clear this top floor. Oh, shit. Oh, that's Bukowski. I almost shot you, Bukowski. Shut your mouth, Bukowski. God, you're such a baby. I gotta do everything around here. Oh, shit. Find some cover. I'm trying to, Bukowski. Look at this guy. Oh. Well, look at that. What a shot. All right, Bukowski. You ready? Bam, 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 bam. the door at the end. I, I heard something. I heard something, too. It was like uh, the sound of a wolverine. Oh, look. We can pick up this weapon. All right, all right. Don't shoot. You Keep your hands up. Son Watch of a Bukowski. bitch. He doesn't move until I've tossed this place. What do you got under there? An undershirt? What the hell is your problem? What are you, 10? Wearing an undershirt underneath a button-up shirt, you son of a bitch. We're gonna have a good look around here. What's this? Hmm, which one do I want to look at first? Fucking, <laughs> I love this. Marquee Printing Co. Okay. Marquee Printing Company. There's nothing like going direct to the source. Yeah, look at this. Holy shit. What a fucking guy. All right. Fine. And what are these? Ah. Betting slip. Betting Looks slips. Looks like Mr. Lightfall has been on a losing streak. Oh, shit. Well, it all starts to make sense now. What do you, uh... You got Gordon Lightfall working for you because he's in so much debt, eh? Mr. Undershirt? fucking guy. Uh, is there anything else worth looking at, Bukowski? Kind of in the way. I mean, I'm trying to have a look around here, and you're just sitting there staring at me, being all awkward with your, your gun. I mean, at ease, soldier. Holy shit, put it away. Alright, you son of a bitch. What do you think? You'll get nothing from me. Yeah, okay. We'll see about that. Look at... What's this? Pink slips? There are enough slips here to keep them stealing cars till Christmas. Wow. Maybe that is what's going on here. We've got a trail of pink slips Christmas stolen car cars racket. that leads right to your door, Bigelow. Yeah, you're Bigelow. You're in up to your neck, but I don't think you're the man in charge. Make it easier on yourself. Give him up. I do work on cars for customers. You charge in here shooting up the place like it's the Ballad of Bulge. Yeah. 
I can't give you anything. The Battle of the Bulge is right. Your, your ghouls started shooting me and my partner, so uh, we shot them back. What do you think of that, eh? Hey, undershirt boy. Hey, what do you got? Little gray undershirt there. What you said? Is, is it How a onesie? How long are we gonna do this? Hey, does it go? Does it attach under the crotch like a baby's? Huh? Hey, Bigelow, you fucking asshole. Uh, all right, pink slip supply. We know about marquee printing. Yeah, you we can know make all this about easier it. on yourself by giving us your man on the inside. Yeah, who's your man? I sometimes repair cars and put them back on the road. I need a pink slip to resell them. Oh, is that right? There's no problem. There. Yeah, well, uh, I know that uh, actually you're uh, you're just like a, a goddamn liar from hell. Look at your shifty eyes looking around. I'm going to doubt you. There are at least yeah. four dead men in this warehouse. A couple more. Punks won't make for that much extra paperwork. We'd be doing the legal system a favor. Yeah. Okay, okay, tough guy. Little? I get the message. Lightfall. The guy who runs Marquis. He's the big shot. He likes to spend big at the track. He owes people. Who does he owe? You tell me. We're gonna we're gonna rip this one out by the roots. Association with Lightfall. Hey, undershirt boy, what do you think, eh? You got an association with Lightfall? We're gonna find out, you Spit son. it out, copper. I ain't got all day. You ain't got all day. Well, fine, okay, let's do this then. Association with Lightfall. Lightfall. The guy with no luck at the track. Tell me about him. One of the guys lying over there. Is he now? You're right. He has no luck. You fucking... What a fucking liar. That is just a blatant lie. That's the best lie you can come up with, Bigelow? Yeah, Bigelow, you fucking Hey, would I lie to you, clown. detective? I'm not exactly in a good position here now, am I? Hey, do you want, uh... You want Bukowski to give you a clown nose and some shoes as well, you fucking son of a bitch? Um... How do we... How do we... How do we do the delivery ledger? Uh, Archer's ownership papers. Uh, how do we prove that he hasn't been... Betting slips? Delivery note. Let's back out of that. We're off the hook. For now. We're gonna doubt it, though. We're gonna doubt you. So Shit! We should have said lie! The story's gonna ring true. I'm warning you, Bigelow. Give it a try, Flatfoot. For some reason. None of my guys like to bring ID to work. Hmm, I see. Whether you give up your bosses or not, Bigelow, you're going away for as long as I can put you there. Oh, shit. We'll see. I didn't fire a shot, copper. I just watched you tear my place up. Damn it. All right, Stan. Take him downtown. His undershirt wearing ass is going to be locked up for a long time. That's right. We got him. We got him in his warehouse full of goons. Uh, okay, we have to go apprehend Gordon Lightvall, apparently, uh, for crimes against humanity. What do you think? Oh shit, look at what's, what's up, guys? Alright, we need to go to uh, Marquee Printing Company. There we go. We're going to set it as a destination and we're going to go apprehend. Bounce. Leave him be. <laughs> I'm angry. We're at the end of the case. You know the way. You can drive. Come on, Bukowski. Take us. Take us to the bridge. That's where we need to go. What a mess. Ugh. Gonna take some cleaning up, that's for sure. All right, here we go. We're at Marquee Printing Co. It is time to bring in Gordon Lightvol uh, for being just a an out of control arrest. crim. You again? This harassment is starting to wear thin. Is that right, Tom Hanks? Deliveries to Industrial Street. We found a box of pink slips in a warehouse full of hot cars. You signed for them, yeah, Lightvol. Yeah, Lightvol. I signed for all the orders and deliveries. You'll need something better than that, cowboy. Well, how about I say that you're lying and uh, I've found your gambling slips, Lightvol. Right? That's a lie. Save it, Lightvol. We already have all we need to send you down. Yeah. I've had enough of this. You either produce some shred of proof or I call my attorney. 
Well, how about these gambling debts? Uh, the betting slips. Hey, we found some betting slips with your name on them. You're in the yeah. hole with the organization. We know about the debts, Lightfall. I agree. I have a small problem. Yeah, I think actually, Gordon, you'll find that your problem you is fucking huge right if now, you I'll son name of a bitch. names. Uh, I need you to keep this out of the paper. No, I I'm need, sorry. I need to shut up yeah, now, Lightfall. That's right, Lightfall. Shut your mouth. Gordon Lightfall, I'm charging you with conspiracy and fraud. Hands behind your back. Yeah, bitch. You're going down. You're going downtown, Leroy the Brown. The LAPD Central Traffic Division has today smashed a nationwide auto theft ring, writes crime correspondent, blah, blah, blah. Oh, here it is. Traffic squad detectives confronted a large group of armed thugs. Yeah. After an exchange of gunfire, more than a dozen dead criminals were removed from the scene. The LAPD sustained no casualties. Damn fine work, fellas. Oh, thanks, Now get Captain. out there and nail some more bad guys, will you? Well, that's it? No cigar, I'll nothing? reading this. Oh, shit. Well, he seems happy enough anyway. <laughs> Fucking guy smiley there. Alright, well, we found uh, as many clues as we could have, 17 out of 18, and we got 20 out of 21 questions correct. Uh, we had a valorous uh, ending to that case, a five-star case closure, a slip of the tongue. Bigelow might be a hood, but he had the dirt on Lightfall and would have flipped if encouraged. I did not actually... Um, catch him out, unfortunately, because I didn't know which one to choose uh, to catch him in the lie. But uh, but there you go. Uh, all things ended well anyway. L.A. Noir, what a game! Like I said, what a great game. My God, I, I'm so grateful for people suggesting this in the February, January, and December game suggestion thread on Reddit. I thank you very, very much. I would have never picked this game up otherwise, and I'm glad I did because it's fantastic. I'm going to keep working through all the cases and all the desks. I'm having a great time. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, let me know if you'd like to see more. We can come back and maybe do another case or something if you like this format. If not, uh, we'll just carry on with other stuff uh as usual thanks very much for watching and i'll see you next time